We want to thank you for submitting all of your questions, and we also want to thank Romeo for having us. The hopes and dreams are here. You guys like hopes and dreams? Love hopes and dreams. Marissa from Piqua asked us, um, what does that say? What's the, what's the question? It says, uh, what's your favorite home cooked meal? <laughs> oh, uh, pancakes and falafels and crepes. Love, love a good crepe. Kate from Boca Raton wants to know what's the first thing we look for in a girl. The answer is blood. All right, Hannah wants to know who we'd like to tour with, the past or present. Um, David Bowie, 1973. Jennifer from uh, Corona del Mar <laughs> wants to know what song is on your iTunes that would surprise others. Hmm. Tiptoe Through the Tulips by Tiny Tim. Uh, probably Home Chris Daughtry. It's my jam. You know what? Early, early Milly Finelli. Lily from Kansas City asks, do you do any rituals before you go on stage? The answer is no. We don't really do anything. At all. Dan from Danville asks, what was my favorite concert and my first concert? Both going to my NSYNC when I was seven. Seven, six years old. I saw NSYNC. And Lance actually threw his, threw his vest out in the crowd. And yeah, the guy next to me got it. So that was kind of. First concert, um, actually, my mom ordered a Margaritaville mixer, and Jimmy Buffett showed up because we were one of the first hundred people to order. Oh. Ironically enough, he made cheeseburgers. Sierra from Boulder, Colorado asks Who's the best rapper in the band? It's me, everyone, but I only ever rap when the beat is wild. Oh, look at this. It's a fortune cookie. Bethany from Fort Wayne asks, what's your luckiest number? Uh, 14, because it Fort Wayne. It's always been 28. Uh, 6,415. Novi from Indonesia asks, what is your favorite type of social media? Um, somewhere between... Twitter, and Napster. Thank you. Oh, Vanessa from New York asks, what word do you say too much? Um, probably um, if not um, then yeah. Probably those two words. And, and YOLO, I say YOLO a lot. Because YOLO uh, means everything to me. YOLO. You know, we had a lot of fun. We really did. We learned some things about each other and, and I think ourselves. And uh, most of all, we want to thank Romeo for having us. Without you, well, I don't think any of us would be here. He's got it.